This is Jordan Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. Well, Drake is experiencing flooding in his mansion, but I'm going to tell you, all of Toronto looks to be flooded. I mean, up to six feet of water in some places, maybe more. I mean, it's cra it's crazy. Um, cars are stuck. I don't know what's causing the flooding. I'm not really up to date on what, what kind of weather's going through there, but it's not good. Like Drake's whole mansion is flooding. Uh, this is definitely uh, a new thing he has to put in his house is to prevent flooding. Maybe put up some flood walls or something because it's looking bad. Now, Remy Ma, okay, she fuels the split from Papoose, her husband. She's now going by her maiden name. She used to go by Remy Mackey. She said this in many... The verse with uh, Little Kim called P featuring Little Kim. Now on Out of Control, Fat Joe, Remy Ma, Cool and Dre, she says Remy Keone Smith. She's back to her maiden name, stating that she is now back on the market or is definitely with Easy the Block Hustle, the Papoose replacement, okay? Um, you know, she's a low down person, man. I mean, Papoose waited for her held her down and she moved on his first chance he got you know it's 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 crazy it's crazy broke up a happy family all that preaching of black love and all this stuff well she destroyed that let's just say that blue face well uh it's not sure if he's gonna get out in a couple weeks but uh you know they're they're hoping that he gets out by the end of July, but it'll probably more likely be the end of August. Kendrick Lamar surpasses Drake by a hundred thousand monthly listeners, making him the number two most streamed rapper. Drake number three, Eminem number one. Rick Ross makes fun of Drake's mansion flooding, but you know Rick Ross likes to make fun of other people's hardships. He says auction it, pops possibly get two M's. And then he says, minor issues. Yeah. Uh, Rick Ross, you know, you don't want to have bad times yourself. I mean, you know, you don't want people making fun. You don't want to make fun of people's bad times, man. You know, like at Rick Ross, you've had plenty of bad times yourself. Well, it looks like the Dazen Project, is that what they're called? It's a Danza Project, sorry. They paid... YSL Woody to do a uh, podcast and he's on here talking spicy reacting to Young Thug's kids dissing Gunna YSL Woody's looking to get clipped man I'm gonna be honest with you because he is posting up his location and daring people to come showing where he's at at the moment you know it's like dude nobody really cares about you you know you, you, you got took the stand against Thug and that's why people are even care a little bit feds have picked up pgf nux case after he was accused of kidnapping a 35 year old man and forcing him to transfer money into his account yeah, that's disgusting bro uh, i don't like i don't like stuff like that um soldier boy says f blue face we're gonna wipe that boy nose soon as he gets out of jail you ain't built like that soldier boy you ain't built like that at all Soldier Boy's trying to get hot again. And he says, you disappointed me, Drake. Doing all them weak songs with them guys. Um, took where uh, it got you. Not, not, look where it got you. None of them guys you collab with or took on tour held your back, Drake. It is true, but, you know, he's looking to go viral. Let's be honest. Little Reese says, uh, Dirks is the flyest guy alive. Pause. No ditty. Looks like Little Reese is looking at Dirk too hard and admiring him and maybe even a little slight attraction. Yeah, so anyways, that's everything that's going on. Um, I appreciate you guys. If you're in the flood in Toronto, can, you know, stay safe. Um, I hope you guys are doing well. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.